Hi guys, welcome back to my channel, or if you're new, welcome. My name is Monica, and today we're doing my 10th update for my Pan That palette for 2018, which if you haven't seen it yet, is the Marc Jacobs Style Icon Palette in Lolita. If you've missed my past updates up until this point, I'll go ahead and throw the playlist up in the cards so you can catch up or refresh your memory, because I feel like this month has been extra long. I don't know why. But we're now in like the home stretch of this project. I'm both scared and excited and nervous. So before we jump into the update, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up if you like Pan That Palette. And if you haven't already and you'd like to, hope you would consider subscribing and hitting that little bell icon so you're notified whenever I post a new video every single Monday through Friday. So if you didn't see the video where I like repressed some of the shades and made Franken shadows, I'll throw that up in the cards. But before we look into what my palette looks like now, let's go ahead and jump into the progression of my palette over the past updates. And this is my palette now. It's a little bit hard to see, but I have hit like extra pan again on the two lighter shades. They're on the edge of their pans and I'm still struggling with that darker shade. So I feel like now that we're in November, this is pedal to the metal, end of the line, like project, like it's almost done. Like I can't say words right now, but we're almost there. The year is almost over, so. I really do want to do another one week one palette with this. I'm not sure if I'll film it since I've already done one. If you missed it, I'll throw that up in the cards. But I feel like I really do need to focus on especially this dark shade once again because my main complaint before was that it was really hard pressed inside the pan and that's why it was taking me so long to hit pan on it. I thought that by mixing it with that lighter like shimmery brown shade that it would make it a little bit less dense but it's still a very dense shadow and it's a very dark, cool toned brown. I can still use this in my hairline, in my brows as liner, so I am gonna do everything that I can to get as far as I can in that brown shade. Now, I know my original goal was just to hit pan on every shade, which I almost did except for this brown shade. Like, I really, think I can finish this up. Especially because I love using this lighter shimmer in the middle as a face highlight. I think I'm going to put the rest of my highlighters away and just focus on this one as my face highlight until the end of the year. The shimmery shade, I can also use that. It, it looks a bit like Fire Crystal in my um, Fenty Kilowatt Freestyle Highlighting Duo. It can make a really intense face highlight. So I might use that, especially as we're getting into the holidays and we're getting into some more glam looks. I just need to focus on this brown shade. I feel like that's still going to be my hang up into the final stretch of this project. But I cannot put down the progress that I've made so far. I've gone so far with this palette and to only have this much product left is a like amazing in and of itself. So I don't wanna be too harsh on myself if I don't end up using the entirety of every shadow in here, but I feel like at this point, if I just buckle down and focus and use the palette every day, I think I can do it by December. Also, quick question. I've decided on my Pan That palette for next year already, and I want to know what you guys think. Would you like to see an intro to a Pan That palette for 2019 in December, or would you like to wait to have that first intro video in January? Because I've already seen some people, like, like I don't want to start, like, my 2019 Pan That palette now. If I were to do the intro, it would be in December, but... 
like to me I don't think it's fair to call it a 2019 pen that palette if you're starting it in like August or September of 2018 I think it's a bit early um, but I mean anyone can really do what they want but personally I would either start it in December or January so let me know I'll throw a poll up or something let me know if you guys want to see that intro for 2019 pen that palette either in December or in January so that is all the updates that I have for this month. We only have two months left. I cannot even believe it. Let me know down below if you're panning something and if you're feeling like as like, oh my God, it's November as I am. <laughs> and let me know how you're doing down below. Thank you so much for watching and I can't wait to see you in my next video.